IELTS Life Skills A1 Spells Visa Test. Hello everyone, this is Angelina. I'm an IELTS coach and a language trainer and I welcome you back to the series of lessons for the preparation of IELTS A1 Life Skills Speaking and Listening Test. Here is a list of 60 important topics. I'm going to mention a link to these topics in the description box and a card in here. You can click on this link and get to watch all these important topics. Today I'm here with another important video for all those candidates who want to appear for the exam in the month of December and January. Recently I was reported by one of my candidates on the YouTube channel and also my student who told me that the recent exam topics were parties, festivals, and cooking food with your friends. Let's talk about these topics. I'm sure you're with me. Let's get started. We will talk about the questions and answers related to all three topics. So stick with me till the end of this video to find out the questions and answers about three topics, parties, festivals, and cooking food with your friends or your best friend. Let's get started with the first one. We'll start off with parties. Now, we all love to party. Party means to have fun. We have birthday parties. We have parties related to wedding anniversaries or even when someone passes an exam, you throw a party. What is it called? Throwing a party means giving a party to someone. So let's talk about some questions. Do you like parties? What kind of parties do you like? Do you like birthday parties? Do you like parties arranged by your family? Do you like parties arranged by your friends? Do you like music parties? Do you like wedding parties? Do you like graduation parties, right? So you can also ask, what do you like to wear when you go for a party? How do you like to dress up when you go for a party? Do you like to wear makeup when you go for a party? With who do you go to parties? Do you like to eat your favorite food on parties? Do you like to take coffee when you go for a party? How do you travel for a party? Uh, do you like late night parties? Do you like parties arranged in the clubs? Mm -hmm. So all these questions you can ask another person about parties. You can also ask, do you like New Year parties? Do you like New Year Eve parties? Do you like to arrange a party for your friends? Uh, do you like surprise birthday parties? Do you like to go to the parties arranged on swimming pool? Do you like beach parties? Do you like parties arranged on hills? So you can take the name of the place and the party or the festival and the party. Just like, do you like birthday parties? Do you like uh, celebration parties? Do you like wedding parties and stuff like that? I hope you guys understand. Let's move to our next topic. The next topic is festivals. Such an important topic. All about festivities. Let's talk about the questions first. Festival. Now, what is a festival? A festival could be a national festival, a seasonal festival, a religious festival, or maybe a festival related to food. So let's talk about some questions. Do you like festivals? What do you like about festivals? How often do you go to festivals? Which is your favorite festival? How do you dress up for different festivals? Do you like religious festivals? Do you like seasonal festivals? Do you like book festivals? Do you like food festivals? Do you like spring festivals? How often do you go to festivals? Which is your favorite festival? Well, you can ask these questions from your partner about festivals. Let's move to the last topic of the day. That is cooking food with your friends. I don't think it's a difficult topic. Let's talk about the questions quickly. Do you like cooking food with your friends? How often do you cook food with your friends? Do you like to cook continental cuisines with your friend? Do you like to cook food with your friends on weekends? What kind of food do you like to cook with your friend? Is your friend a good 
cook. Do you like to cook food with your friend when you go for a picnic? Do you like to cook food with your friend indoors or outdoors? Do you like to cook spicy food with your friend? Do you like to cook the local cuisines with your friend? And do you like to cook barbecue with your friends? So there are so many questions that you can ask about cooking food with your friend. Now let's answer these questions. I'll answer the questions about parties first. Yes, I like going to parties. I like birthday parties. I like wedding parties. I like celebration parties and I also love parties arranged on different festivals and different occasions just like New Year, Christmas, Eid or any other celebration. I also like to dress up on parties. I love to wear beautiful, glamorous, shiny dresses. I like to wear makeup. I wear my favorite jewelry and my favorite watch. I go to parties with my family and with my friends. When I go to the party, I like to travel by car. I don't like to travel by public transport. When I go to the party, I love to dance, I love to eat food in the parties, and I also enjoy music in the parties. I love to take photos uh, in parties, and I like to spend good time with my friends in the parties. And it's a lot of fun to attend parties. If you're a person who doesn't like going to the parties, then you can say, I don't like parties. If somebody will ask you a question why you don't like parties, then you can say that I like to stay at home and I don't like going to the parties. But there are some parties that I like that are arranged by family. I like family get togethers, celebration parties at home, parties arranged for birthdays or parties arranged for uh, wedding anniversaries or the family parties, uh, celebrations of the family. I enjoy those parties. I don't like going to the clubs. I don't like going out with the friends to enjoy parties. I love doing party with my family and friends at home in general. Or sometimes I go to a restaurant uh, with my family and friends to celebrate an occasion or celebrate an achievement or celebrate something. Thank you. Now let's move to the next topic and answer the question for festivals. Our next topic that is festivals. I like festivals. I like religious festivals, seasonal festivals like winter festivals, autumn festivals, spring festivals and I also like summer festivals like going to the beach, going to the swimming pool. Um, there, there are many uh, summer festivals where they arrange cold drinks and many other activities for children. So I like going to the summer festivals with my children. I also like religious festivals like Christmas is in their Eid, Diwali, all these festivals are religious festivals so that you can say that I also like to celebrate religious festivals. I like to dress up on different festivals and I go to the uh, food festivals also because I'm a foodie. I love to enjoy food and I go to junk food festivals. I like book festivals. You can also talk about book festivals that I like to go to book festivals where I uh, buy books or novels of my interest. I like to go with my friends. Uh, I like to invite my friends on different festivals. We go to different places on festivals and I also enjoy eating sweet food on festivals. Let's move to the last topic of the day that is cooking food with your friends. Yes, I like cooking food with my friends because uh, my friend is a very good cook. Whenever she visits me, whenever she comes at my home, we cook together. She cooks biryani, she cooks uh, continental cuisines and she is so good at cooking Chinese food. And so we always cook together. I chop the vegetables and I also wash the meat for her and I also give her the ingredients and she is the cook and she cooks food with me. Sometimes I cook food with her and it is a lot of fun to cook food with my friends or in case uh, you want to say something else you may. Well, I hope you learned something. This was just a quick review to uh, the recent exam topics. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Keep supporting. It means a lot so that I can keep coming out with more topics for you and make it super simple for you to pass this test without any failure. Thank you so much.